The number of active cases in the metro continue to rise. And the increase has been evident since the easing of lockdown restrictions last month. The metro says areas that were relevantly low in numbers during the third wave have begun to spike. These areas include Motherwell, Kwanobuche and Kwazakele. The indicate, indications are that we could see quite an increase coming once again. So areas that we are worried about, um, up until now, it's been mainly our city or suburban areas with um, our northern areas being infected. And they are still the areas we're concerned about because they are the highest. But we have seen a trend that's just started over the last week or so where areas like Motherwell, Kwazakele, Kwanabushli have just started to show going the wrong way. Their figures have been very low up until now. They're still low, but we are concerned that they are starting to pick up some. The Department of Health says health facilities in the metro are stable at this stage with sufficient capacity. However, the department has stressed for more people to register for vaccination. So we would clearly want to improve it. So as a department, we firstly want to encourage persons who are eligible to register. But even if you are not registered, we want to assure the public that we have at our sites, the, we will assist you to register and do vaccinations on site. At the moment in the Nelson Mandela area, we've actually got 52 sites, public vaccination sites, that are open from Mondays to Fridays from 8.30 until 3 p.m. in the afternoon. Residents are also calling for more law enforcement visibility to clamp down on those who transgress. It would be helpful to make people to be aware or to be, to be serious, to take it literally serious because this thing is affecting everybody. If such enforcement is so weak, it's not going to help us. And as you can understand, people tend to be responsible when they are driven to that direction of responsibility. If there is no one who drives them to that direction, they tend to be so negligent. The concern is now we see the fluctuation in the drop in, in the numbers. And that is basically what makes us so uncertain and a little bit anxious. Um, if, if, we, if we can work together as a community and we, each, each one just do his or her part by wearing the mask, covering the nose and mouth, as the president said. If the cases is rise, it's because of careless of us. Because we don't want to understand and we don't want to accept there is the real thing is here. COVID-19 is here, this is the real thing. Some of us people are still doubting that now I'm going to see when it's happening to me and when it's come to me. But we must understand and we must accept that COVID-19 is here and COVID-19 is here to stay. The Metro has already fully vaccinated over 10% of its 1.2 million population. Luando Nomoi, SABC News, Kabeja.